What's up guys, Euclid back here with you again, and today we're going to be starting a new series with my friends Ben and Josh, and taking a look at the game mode Crash Frigate, brought to us by Brandon Ray 71 as well as several other unmentioned creators of different free, pav free fabs that are used in the map. Crash Frigate has a very vague description, read it as follows. Crashed on an unknown world, being hunted by the banished. So we, I'm guessing as elements of a UNSC task force on a crashed frigate, are again crashing on an unknown world that is already occupied by banished forces and it you can kind of see the gravity of that based on the assault carrier in the sky based on elements of ships tanks planes and then of course the mining facilities that are present in this map now one thing that i liked about this is that it gave a very nostalgic feel to linear maps in halo we really enjoyed that when the area opened up there were elements of armor elements of troop transports it, it kind of felt like we weren't slogging over empty pieces of map, which for people that, you know, did enjoy the Halo Infinite campaign, but felt it was empty, you don't get this feeling from this game mode. Now, it was enjoyable. All three of us loved it, as you can see, but the biggest thing that we really enjoyed about it, <laughs> though I think could be expanded upon, was the presence of Swords of San Helios allies, because it is a task force between UNSC, and oh, there's Vin's assault rifle with the San Helios Major. It was really cool. Now, those elements of troops that allied with us died before the battle really even began, before we left the frigate. So if I were to give one critique to this lovely free content we were able to play, thank you again, Brandon, is just that try to expand it to where maybe there are more elements of that frigate and try to, if you can, if it's even possible or potential, to regroup those elements. Give us a nostalgic callback to the level Halo from Combat Evolved. Now, it was fun. There were always options. We could kind of go whichever way we wanted to when dealing with armor in open areas, such as the first banished ship, which we did have trouble figuring out how to get into that ship, but that was no bother. There were plenty of weapons. There were plenty of options available to us. There were different routes, so it was linear, but in a way that it felt like, again, combat evolved. The mining facilities set up by the banished were an awesome you know, inclusion. The phantoms bringing in armor was well done, and it didn't have this weird effect where you could see them shrinking into the map. It seems like care was taken that these you know, enemy dropships would appear, and you would only see them in their normal size. That was a really big takeaway from Infinite that I felt like it was just a rush project. And it's nice to see somebody who, admittingly, has a lot more free time, but was able to put something together for us. So Brandon, we really appreciate what we've seen. In a closing, I think we would give this mod a 3.5 out of 5. And for the effort, it's obviously a 5. You know, we, we got it for free. But a 3.5 out of 5 is fair. A lot of different engagements with enemies. A lot of different, you know, situations. Open areas with armor. And the choice to use that armor against it all. So, if you want to continue to watch, our gameplay comes up next. Thank you for watching. Oh, yeah, there we go. So there's Marines getting murdered. <laughs> Just a very long preamble. I was worried too. I was like, did I do something wrong? <laughs> cool. What's up, gentlemen? Jeez. So they basically, they're not expected to survive long enough for you to save them. Oh, so. Holy shit. Oh, that was cool. Oh God! <laughs> gotcha. His helmet's off. Hey, is this a good time to tell you guys how proud of you I am? Because yes, I am. It's a great time to say that. <laughs> I'm proud of you. Hammer time to play with All a guy right. back in the Xbox Xbox 360 days in Halo 3. He would just run around with a gravity hammer on sand traps screaming it's hammer time. Y'all check out the cruiser in the skybox. Oh, oh that ain't a cruiser, is it? No. Oh, that's a... Uh... Dang, if I was a Halo lore nerd, I'd know this. Oh, I'm not a real fan. Is it an assault carrier? Yeah. Probably that sounds right. What's up there? There's just BR ammo. Oh, okay. Nothing of interest. I think we go this way, right? Yeah, definitely this way. Is it bad that I think the sidekick is my favorite gun in Infinite? No, it's really, really good. The 
this a friendly lead? Yes, it is. Oh, bro, I'm so sorry. What up, ho? Oh. Do they have a hammer? I want to give him a hammer. How did he get that? I gave it to him. Oh. I thought it'd be cool. Chibi! Nice. Come out and fight. Ooh, striker sidekick. I was just talking about having a nice little pistol. That not no, just a decoration, okay. Wow. Up here, gentlemen. Allied elite. He don't he won't come up with us, I'm assuming. Uh, he ain't following us unfortunately. It's all right. I'm surprised there's not more of the experience if like, people have like friendly elites. Like, I would think that people would be doing that. Oh nice, you already got him. <laughs> Enough. Yeah. Uh, beautiful. And this area reminds me of that piece of art oh. that you did with the Orion's garden. Oh yeah, that's funny. No gun for you, Mister. Thanks, dude. Oh, are you joking? You die? Yeah, he pulled his no, whoa, 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 plasma whoa, grenades whoa. out last second. We gotta pull back and respawn you. Or did he respawn? You're good. I respawned. Copy, copy. Well, he said fight me. I'm gonna do it. You're just respecting his wishes. Right. He's pretty, these general yeah, snipers are still pretty dangerous in this game. Try not to underestimate him. Is that a dead brute or is it alive? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Yo, he's leading so an aerobic class. Arms. <laughs> he's these arms. That's so funny. <laughs> He's leading a. This has been an excellent class. Richard Simmons is nothing on this guy. <laughs> oh my god. Hell yeah. Wow. Oh, no, no, I want to get out. Hey, no. Like, get your <laughs> ass back down there. <laughs> I kill myself. I'm stuck. If I hit him, he'll like fly back. He'll fly down faster. <laughs> No, you launched him. He goes back down. There he goes. <laughs> Jump in, Yay! Okay. Woo. He's doing it upside down. <laughs> Greatest. <laughs> this is like the ab lounge in 2554. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. I'm done here. <laughs> Stupid. Ghost. I love there's this guy poured so much work into this mod and we're sitting there for five minutes watching a brute do aerobics. Like, <laughs> yeah. I love it. Well, I wish I had a flashlight, baby. Ooh. Ooh. Just Halo things. Guys. Nice. Ooh, a chopper. Current is on meth. Of that. <laughs> hmm. I'll tell you what. All right. Nope. Nice. Would you make it in? Nice. 
It looks we get cool the with the fire. <laughs> Whoa, you scared the crap out of me then. Alright. <laughs> what up, Boogity Boo? We're gonna try and put all our vehicles in there. Make us a little sandwich. Pardon me, excuse me, pardon me. How do we get open the door? That's the question. Are we even supposed to be in here? No. Surely, yes, right? <laughs> Maybe not. Maybe not. Not at all. They they don't, wheel the chopper. There is a big giant door on, on the other side. Like a energy shield. Oh, jeez. Alright, bro. Oh, you're fine. I might actually need you to do that because I can't get over the ramp. Yeah, they might have abandoned the chopper anyways, so. My oh, only. Did I fuck it up? Can you oh, you're can good. you do the wheelie with the A button? The controller? Yeah, the chopper's fucked. I'm gonna have to leave it. <laughs> Alright. One critique I have is that some of these places that are really dark need some fill lights, some something to Do you think that's a map limitation for that or just the fact that he like just I don't cut know. it down if it did? I don't use Forge, so I don't know. If we had flashlights that would help. And that would help, but I'm just trying to. Yeah, it'd be nice it. if you could use flashlights in the multiplayer. Bunch of cowards at three four three not giving us flashlights. Oh my god! <laughs> okay. The hell is ever here? Go this way. Oh my! Well, here we go. Like. Oh. Too dark. Oh, are we supposed to go over to the gate? I think we're supposed to go over there, yeah. I saw it earlier when I, I was killing double jackals. <laughs> I don't know how we're supposed to get through it, though. The hell? We're missing something. Surely. Are we all supposed to remain in that door up on the ship for a second? Like, could that trigger something? I don't think so. Not there, yeah, okay. Huh. Well, hot damn! I don't know what the fuck we're supposed to be doing right now. My only other guess is there's a console somewhere with a button that you can hit. Yeah, maybe. Seems like a possibility. Like there's gotta be something in that ship interior that we miss. Oh uh, yeah, I think you're right. Look all sides. Okay. You walk up to the door, you just teleport through it. Uh, Are you <laughs> kidding me? We just couldn't do it with our vehicles. I got a hammer. Enough out of you, mister. This can't be happening. <laughs> Beautiful. Y'all notice we're not fighting any elites? Yes. Oh, I forgot jackals are on roids now. Underestimate these enemies a lot. <laughs> Got more ammo though. Win. Jesus, it sent me a mile back. Oh, and then spawn guys between me and you guys. That was a little fucked up. Yeah, a little fucked up. <laughs> what the fuck happened? 
I got punished for being shit. There we go. Hey, now it's one you put over there. <laughs> What is this game? I don't know. Good assholes. Thank you, gentlemen. And this door is open now as well. So many different campaigning experiences. Maybe? Ah! Ah, rah, rah, boom, yay! Ooh! Hello! Take that. It's just a weapons container? Iberia? Yeah. So what are we doing? Okay, up? so is it that way then? First lesson, you gotta direct the player somehow. Right. Run up against this door. Does it open? Like no. No. Hit the switch again. If you don't mind if you're there. I can do it. If you want to check I it, know. got it. Okay. I'll watch the door. We'll watch the door. I don't think it's doing anything. No, so remember it spawned enemies where, like, in the corridor where it sent you back to, so I'm wondering if we're supposed to backtrack. <gasps> Did you hit the switch earlier? Yeah. That would exp Maybe that's why. Yeah, that's why it's... Okay. Then yes, that would make Maybe sense. Maybe now we've hit the switch, we can go through that gate. Plasma grenades yeah. Obtained. Now it allows us. I'm yep, okay with... I think so. Man, I don't mind figuring it out, you know. Still enjoying it, but... It also... It also points out... How much is capable in this game. How much we should be getting campaign-wise. I'm, oh, yeah. I'm gonna be a salty salamander, I have to. That's that's okay. I think we're all pretty salty about. It. Oh, my, oh god. my god! They just murdered me, dude. Crap. <laughs> Leave, grunt. This isn't your party. I got annihilated. What kind of meth is this dude on? Yeah. No, you. Are they all using the campaign one? Is that why? Shut your mouth. Good job, gentlemen. Ooh. It's in the shot. Dangerously cheesy. Yay! Invisible walls. That's the final boss. Oh, hello. Conduit. Turrets? Yes, they are. Lovely! Wow, great for hunter killing. <laughs> I'm just saying, right? Where is he? You all hear that? It's scaring me. Up above. <laughs> 
Yeah, he's upstairs. I see the ramp. He's dead. Uh, guys, does anybody want a rocket or a sniper? I'll take whichever one you don't want. Rifle. I think the premise is that he killed a bunch of elites. Humans. They're set, they're okay. depicting like a horror scene up here. That's pretty cool. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah. You see that like he was so fucking dangerous that he killed what looked like some pretty experienced troops of both species there. Yeah. I That's like really that. Neat world building. Yeah. I'm all for it. I think we go, can we go this way? Maybe that light was supposed to be a signifier. Yep, right. Word to your mother. So dark. <laughs> it is really Just a hard. little bit of fill light. Please. Use a bunch of flares like they did in like the chasms when you'd find all those missing marines in the campaign. Oh um, yeah. You can use a few I, little flares and lights. Yeah, if it's possible. I mean, you have to. I feel like if you're making forge maps, you have to turn your brightness down some to test your map and see what people with different uh, brightness levels are going to experience. If you design your map and it's your brightness is set too high, other people aren't going to be able to see. Right. Uh, did y'all see the stair thing over there? I was looking at that, yeah. This is a pretty vast environment. I, I gotta give him props. This area is cool. Pretty nasty. Ooh. Oh, this is reminiscent of things. Yeah, so there's dead Marines all over the place. Myself a band. I like this. Me too. It's it's pretty sweet. Yeah, the world building is I'm nice. Getting Sonic Archiver vibes. Yes. Where did... Right here. I think it has glass in front of it. Fuck the scrap can. I want to save whoever they're fighting. Oh, here it is. Oh, is it... Again, lighting it helps there. Yeah. I it's just too dark, it. yeah. It's too dark, yeah. Wait a minute. These are our guys. Oh, they're not. Okay. Holy shit. So were they fighting each so other? Another. My shields pop. Another game thing there. Ooh. The only elite we met at the beginning was an ally. Yeah. And then suddenly we meet invisible elites who are not our ally. Guessing the elite yeah, at the beginning was supposed to be swords. Was that Helios? Probably. Right, cannon time. So, okay, so were they fighting each other? Those two forces, or were there guys were, in the middle it getting might have slaughtered? Been, maybe there's a third faction or something, because these are Covenant crates. Okay, uh, see, he's not attacking until you get close. That's confusing. It is a little confusing. I'm trying to see if there's any... Okay, so maybe they're just representative of a Covenant remnant faction, not banished. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Yeah, that's cool. I like that. That makes me want to go and reread the um, Julem Dama books. Absolutely.
Oh, this is badass, dude. The fallen sentinels and sentinel beams are a nice touch. Yeah. In general, the environment stuff is really cool. I think that cleared it. Crab <laughs> <laughs> cannon's a little OP. Literally good. Really good. That no boy. We'll be real with you. I think I'll always prefer the Covenant aesthetic. Shoot the big guy. We should just work with the enemies to kill the big guy and then finish him off. Temporary truce. Holy shit. Oh. You barbarian! I'm gonna stay back because I do not want to die. I kinda forgot. Uh, it's all good. Um, that'd be. That'd be the melee attack on them, thing. I know. Adjusting models. Oh my god! Here! Oh god. <laughs> I'm gonna go back and see if there's a weapon still lying around here. Oh, there's a door back here, guys. There is a door we missed. Weapons. Oh. Oh, oh, oh anime elite. Okay. Well, we swordsman, swordsman. I don't have ammo. Thank you. Ooh, give me that shit. Thank you for saving me and not steal his weapon. What a jerk. <laughs> Ooh, this will come in handy. But yeah, it was dead spartans there's some world building for sure but i like multiple factions warring i miss that about older titles there's also another door i think this is a separate door no that's the door we came in earlier okay sure. Ooh, okay. oh they got They have freaking homing missiles, okay? Holy shit. Uh, oh god. Go oh, home, I barely go did home. it. I barely did it. <laughs> Holy shit. Ah! I mean, it's risky. All I have is a pokey thing. Out of ammo. Must grab enemy gun. Dude, enemy. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, nope, nope. Ooh, hello, Sentinel Beam. Can ya? Good job, boyos. Ooh. Whoa. <laughs> you know who my, has yes, my favorite you. absolute laugh of any Halo character ever? Who's that? Yeah, yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Got here. <laughs> it's, it's like creepy, but it's also really badass at the same time. I was actually all on board for that. Jesus. Triple punch. Like show on him, huh, guys? Like... It was... Did somebody yeah. run down this way? Oh. <laughs> oh wow. More world building. Cool. Is that overkill? Doesn't matter. <laughs> this is fucking cool. Different avenues. More world building. I think there's more bodies up here. Yep, there is. I love oh. it. Nice. It's just so dark, you can't tell who the combatants were. But it looks like a Jirohanai. You know, the actual name of the species. And they fall in yeah, for hearts. Yeah. yeah, it looks good. 
Litter the field with what looks like a struggle. Shut your mouth. <laughs> My God. That could have got going really bad. I was scared, dude. You are the reason we beat him, though, because you did that, I think. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> we'll take it, right? <laughs> Ooh. I, I, I knew he was going after you, and I'm like, I'm just going to stab him. <laughs> At this point, it's time to shank. There's a... I feel it's like... Go ahead, sorry. It's so cool how big these maps are. Yes. Uh, well, it just, it really does beg the question of what could have been. I'm a sad, oh, you let me drive all. Yeah. What is that over there? Oh my. Oh, I'll take the tank then. Y'all want to take the- Yeah, let's search the wreckage other. real okay. quick. Dude, I love it. The effort that's being put into like different struggles and parts of the story. I appreciate. We are reconnaissance, and he is armor. Enemy wraith. Oh yes. Those pontoons. I'll keep them arranged for you, buddy. How I'm dead. How they barraged me with freaking hunter bullets. Hang on, brother. Very, very it's gonna be tight. It's gonna be tight. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Gotta go get banned. Hunter, I'm gonna focus fire him. Oh! Oh my God! Sorry right, if I'm not making it easy on you. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Well, at least we're dodging his shit. Now. There you go. All right. A whip around and you get Ben. Get him. You didn't destroy your tank. No. Enemy down. Oh, one of them, anyways. All right, those enemies are down. Oh yeah, brother. Wondering. It seems like dealer's choice in which direction we want to go. And, and even if that's not the case, it feels that way, which is a very Halo thing to do, dare I say. Yeah. Oh yeah. I'm still looking, okay, well now we got a light. I'm still looking for like random encounters and like bodies where potential skirmishes that we were too late to intervene in. That's a very Halo thing to do. And again, that brings me to like, well, it really any level, especially Combat Evolved, I think was the best at that. Not saying that just because Josh is here. <laughs> I mean, I would agree with that. I really do. I think it really told a visual story of like, we were just too late. Oh, we got Wraiths. We got two Wraiths. Yep, hang on. Ben, I will distract them as best I can, all right? I'm gonna get them turned around so you can hit them right in the ass. Copy that. Hang on, Josh. Goop. There's fire. That was close. Closer than I wanted it to be. Good job, boys. Looks like you got a really good shot on that one to the right first, too. Oh, yeah. The There's... first one went down real well. Are we supposed to hit those things? Shoot those, yeah. Yep. It just gave me scare of flashbacks because of the way, like you said earlier. Is that going to blow up? Should we be backing up? Victory. Oh, nice. That's, that's cool. Ooh, anticlimactic. Very but still cool. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. But but it but that's a lot of effort considering. 
I really appreciate that. That's cool. I did like the ending. I think the only thing that would have improved the ending is if they could script music and if there was more going on. If there were ghosts and choppers and, and ground units and the wraiths. Yes. That would have been neat. Yeah. I agree. If there if it felt more he if it felt more like the uh uh, mission on the Ark with the Scarabs, with as far as like layout of ground units and vehicles and things. Yeah, yeah, I would agree. You can't generate a giant explosion, but like some sort of cue would have been cool if it was possible. Yeah, like, yeah. you did it. Thing. I agree. That was neat. I, I think, despite some problems with it, from like a, a if you can iterate on it perspective, I think there's a lot of work, like a lot of hard work on display there. There is, so. and, and like lighting but i'm gonna be real with you i like there was a lot to appreciate but i think my absolute favorite thing was you know, as you mentioned the environmental storytelling it matters a lot more than i think people might realize that you put a few dead npc bodies living around as if there were conflicts that really does add to the world and it needs to be done more yeah. in my opinion in games Oh, and just to have a shout out in the video that was made by the private chief, and he credits Brandon Ray seventy one for the brand banished ship interior and creators of many other different prefabs, which isn't something I thought about. But like, we're at a point now where people have made so many different prefabs that like making these larger scale campaign style levels is a lot easier. Oh yeah, so I really do think that's something the game has going for it. Yeah, I think I think that that map would be really good just with some. Especially some lighting tweaks, and then probably more encounters. Model some of it off of the actual campaign levels that people love. So, yep. But that was fun. And cut the random friendly elite thing in the beginning if it's not going to go anywhere. I mean, I was so expecting like some friendly elites, and it was I, I, I had right. an amazing time just giving him my MA5B. Like that was just <laughs> thing for me. But, I know. Like I expected us to run ahead and find more of him. More of yeah. them. And because like when we heard the gunfire and then it actually ended up being a fight between and I do like this, but it gave the illusion that we were gonna run into more allies, maybe more swords of San Helios. And um if that's what that was meant to be. And but instead it was a yeah. covenant remnant versus banish, which I also do like though. I do like that. Yeah. Same here. Yeah. Yeah. Gravity. Thank you further thoughts on that that you want to share yes i think we all agree about the lighting just is a critique because we want to see it succeed when we see effort all you want to do is see it do better because it deserves to the lighting even more environmental storytelling reward the player for curiosity that's one of the biggest things i miss about games from long ago it doesn't happen as much anymore environmental storytelling add things add scenarios if you Took a, you took 30 seconds to walk out of the way of the main path, reward that player with a nice little rifle or some an, a, additional ammo for a rocket or something. It, it's, I, I'm not saying it's yeah. easy, but I do think that people do appreciate that more than you might suspect. So, um, yeah, I, I, I think there's that. I do like the vehicles. I do like the crashed Pelican was a nice little ode, but maybe add some more dead Marines around that. The reason the equipment's not being used that felt like a nice shout out to Assault on the Control Room um, at other levels. You know, like they were trying to deliver armor, but they were quite too late because, you know, there, there was a bum rush to get everything. And um, what I liked the most about it is it felt like earlier Halo titles where we were fighting a losing battle back to the fall, but kind of turning it around to an effective response. Um, I don't know. It's, it's fun to see. And if I continue to see more like that, then I think we'll continue to play more. That's my thoughts on that. Definitely. Yeah, great.